What's going on guys? Pro Player Apathy back in the building with another video. And in today's video, what I'm going to be talking about is stock versus long barrel on the submachine gun. Now, this is something that's been in talks recently, something that people have been using on and off. People have been switching long barrel, stock, stock, long barrel, long barrel again, stock. And they don't really know what to use. So today I'm going to be talking a lot about them and, you know, their benefits and the disadvantages, the pros, the cons, all that stuff. So yesterday we were playing Cole. I was using stock. I've always been using stock. Sometimes when I play against other stock players, I don't play too well because they strafe me. They outstrafe me and then I'm kind of fucked. But then sometimes I use long barrel and I dominate. So I, I question myself, like, what am I doing, right? What am I doing right? What am I doing wrong? I really don't understand this whole situation. And today, this is what exactly what I want to be talking about. So... When you're obviously playing a stock player, it's kind of hard at that guy right there stalking. I just flew that one player stock. But when you're stalking, like it's hard to kind of when they're strafing you, it's hard for you to kill them, right? Because you're constantly strafing. It's hard for you to hit those shots. But at the same time, if you have stock back, it's easier. So stock versus stock is usually a better thing. And, you know, that's usually what kind of hurts me sometimes. Like when someone's using stock, I want to use stock too because then you start out strafing me. It doesn't. It starts. It doesn't look too good. It starts looking really bad. It doesn't look too good because I'm getting outstrafed. There's nothing really I can do about it. He's just moving too fast to the left, and I can't hit those shots. So that's why right here I'm using. I'm currently using long barrel. And yesterday when we played Cole, I decided to use long barrel. You know, I was like, you know, I'm tired of this stock shit. I'm tired of using stock. Let's see how long barrel does. And I actually was dominating them. And the thing is, like, what people don't understand. I know you guys. Most of you guys saw Drifter's video. Or a lot of you guys know that long barrel isn't the best, right? It isn't as effective as it is in ARs. Only increases the damage longer by a little bit. But what you guys understand that is what the fuck? And especially in competitive COD where there's only a couple of gunfights, like you're always one v one a person. Having that 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 slight advantage over someone, like if someone has fucking trip my if someone has stock and you don't and you have long barrel, and let's say they're not running a selfish class, let's say they only have stock, they don't have long barrel, but you do have long barrel, there's times where you're gonna win the gunfight instead of them because of that extra damage. So in reality, reality, like it's obviously like you know what you want to do and what you feel like using or what you feel better with. But you know, vice versa, like they're they're both good. It just depends on the player. Like I'm gonna tell you guys right now, Zuma uses stock almost all the time now. That's like Zuma's favorite thing. I love stock too. I'm not gonna say here and lie, but there's games where I don't play too well, and I feel like I'm just not leading my shots because when you also use stock, you use stock to miss make them miss bullets and for you to hit your shots easier. But there are times when if they're using stock or you're just too focused on moving around too much while you're shooting that you start missing some shots. So that's a big thing. A lot of you guys know Attach and Zuma. I was actually curious what they were using because Zuma always uses stock like I was saying. So I look at Attach's class and Attach uses, usually uses long barrel. So they're like two different players. One likes to use stock. The other one likes to use long barrel on their sub. And like I said, like after yesterday playing Cole... Like, playing Cole in that best seven wager and realizing that, you know, long barrel is still a good thing. Like, I should stop worrying about stock too much. Like, there are games where I don't play too well or where I don't I don't, I don't, don't finish off kills. And then I realize, like, maybe it's because I don't have long barrel on and it finally hit me. And, you know, this is something that I think it's up to you. Like, you should try them both out. But at the end of the day, don't think one is more superior than the other. Just think of it as what fits you best, what do you like more, what do you perform better with. You know, like I said, there's games where I use stock, I completely dominate, and then there's games where I just can't kill, I'm not cleaning up kills, you know, getting kills that I usually do, and that's where Long Barrel comes in hand. So, hope you guys enjoyed this live con real quick, don't forget to have a good day, and like, comment, subscribe, this has been your boy Afti, pure dominance, use whatever the fuck you want to use, and I'm out, peace.